So, let me get this straight, Christian. You're from another world. You don't remember how you got here. And you speak telepathically? Correct, Stella. We've learned how to control our thoughts. Unlike your people, it seems. And what's that supposed to mean? You're smart enough to figure it out. Are you hungry? I can make us some food. Wow, someone gets angry quick. <sighs> Don't forget my food! Hey, I'm going off to work. Are you good for today? Yes. Are you going to stay out late again? Yeah, you might have to make dinner yourself. Seriously? I can't use my hands with these crutch things and I don't know how to work your kitchen. You know what? Don't worry about it. I won't be late. But please don't mess everything up again because you're bored. Watch TV or something. There is plenty for you to do. Bye. The stars look really nice out there. Well, you could go out on the patio. It's dark enough. No one would see you. Yeah, right. You say that now? Wait until I actually leave. You just want me out of here. I don't. You're not healed yet anyways. Like you actually care. Whatever. Suit yourself. Hey Stella, give me some of that food we had for dinner. Can't you get it? I'm a little busy right now. What? One of your charity projects again? They don't actually matter. Like you? These projects are important. They help others. I'm not just some charity case. You should be grateful that I let you help me. <laughs> grateful? You wouldn't have lasted a day with anyone else. You fell into my backyard, and I brought you into my home and let you be rude to me for months while you've been healing and resting. You've done nothing to help me, and you say that I should be grateful to you. Jeez, why are you humans so dramatic? You haven't met any other humans! You've cooped up inside because you're too good to go out and let others see you. I am not being dramatic. I'm finally telling you how I feel. How about what I feel? I'm alone on an unfamiliar planet with no idea how to get home. No idea what's happened to my people, and completely lost in your culture. And I don't know what will happen if I leave this house. I've seen how you humans treat people who are different. Oh really? How? TV! I... I didn't think about it like that. I'm sorry. I should have tried to see it from your point of view. It's not all your fault. I guess I've been trying to avoid my anger, and I've taken it out on you. This just in. There have been multiple reports of people seeing strange creatures with spikes along their shoulders and necks. Hey Christian, come listen to this. It sounds like there's other people from my world here. Some have these spikes trailing down their backs and along their arms and legs. Their skin tones vary from those we're familiar with to purples, blues, and reds, or a mixture thereof. These creatures that have been seen wandering the streets have been apprehended until we can find out their intentions here on Earth. Please don't panic. We will continue with updates as we receive them. This isn't good. We need to do something. Like what? We can't just go parading you around saying you're safe, so your people are too. They are safe. I bet they're just as scared as I was when you found me. We have to help them. Okay then, we need a plan. 